On a sad note, Parliament has eulogized three-time former minister and former member of Parliament for Ginger West constituency, Henry Kisada Chemba, describing him as a statesman who promoted good governance, justice for all, and a humble servant who associated with all above self. In spite of the opposition being on boycott of parliamentary proceedings, the leader of opposition, Matthias Sampuga, says it was common sense to come back and pay tribute to a fallen statesman. The casket containing the body of three-time former Minister Henry Chamber arrived at Parliament at 10 a.m. and was received by the Deputy Speaker Thomas Taiwa and other dignitaries. <laughs> The body then lay in state for viewing before taking it to parliamentary chambers for legislators to pay tribute. The motion to pay tribute was moved by the first Deputy Prime Minister and Minister for East African Affairs, Rebecca Kadaga, who described the letter as a statesman who promoted good governance, justice for all, and democracy. was a firm advocate and promoter of democracy, good governance, peace, rule of law, respect for human rights. The leader of opposition, Matthias Simpuga, who seconded the motion, started by submitting on their presence in the House, in spite of being on boycott. Just to assure the House that we came for this sitting and retreat back in our bunker until normalcy returns home. Mpuga, together with the Dean of Independence, Livingstone Zijan, said the letter was an impeccable civil servant and politician with no scandal. Generous offered time and space to whoever came to him with a thirst to sit down at the feet of a guru to learn. Minister of State for Animal Hus uh, Industry and Fisheries, no scandal. Constituency Assembly Delegate, no scandal. The other legislators who also described the late Henry Chamber as a politician who had great relationship with all great men in this world, practiced mature politics and a humble servant for all. He valued friendship so much, not like us today, who are fond of backstabbing each other. I've known him as a humble and very obedient politician. Is one of the figures that Busoga as a sub-region is indeed proud of. He was a statesman. And for some of you actually who dealt with Honorable Chamber, some of the colleagues who went out, everything for him was a statesman, a statesman. The late chamber will be laid dressed on Thursday at his ancestral home in Bugembe in Ginger City. Alex Mugasha, Sam Ibanda Mugabi, NBS, Live at 9.